Welcome back to The Bible Says What? Today I'm going to give an introduction to the book of Ruth. This book was written in the period of the Judges of Israel. No one knows for certain who wrote this book of the Bible, but it most likely was written by someone in King David's family during his reign in Israel, around 3,020 years ago. The woman named Ruth lived around 3,100 years ago. It is a true story about a Gentile woman who decided to follow the God of Israel and about her loyalty and love to her family. Ruth was a woman who was a Moabite. If you remember in Genesis, Lot's two daughters got him drunk and slept with him. The oldest daughter had a son from this encounter and his name was Moab. He was the first of the Moabites. This book of the Bible is only four chapters long. The book paints a picture of the hard times the Israelites were having in one of their dark ages. During the period of the judges when Israel did not have a king, but instead had people called judges ruling over them, there was a famine. There seemed to be many famines in that part of the world down through the ages. Elimelech and Naomi and their two sons went to the land of Moab to find food. While they were there, their two sons got married to two foreign women. Now while they were in that foreign land, all the males died, leaving the women alone. The book of Ruth tells the story about King David's great-grandfather and great-grandmother. It is an important book and it shows the importance of integrity and loyalty. And it shows how God takes care of his people. In the following four videos, I will summarize each chapter of the book of Ruth. I will identify what I think the most important verse or verses are. And I will document what I think God wants from all of us in response to reading this chapter. As usual, these videos should in no way be a replacement for all of you to read the whole chapters for yourself. Do your own studying. You won't regret it. Have you ever trusted Jesus for your salvation? Repent for your sin and turn from it. Ask God to forgive you. Place your faith in Jesus and what he did on the cross. Believe the Father raised Jesus from the dead. Scripture says that you will be eternally saved if you do. Do it today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy the Roof series, give the episodes a thumbs up and share them. See you next time. Thank <laughs> you.